here. Can you feel it? You found the shrine. Anoint it with your apothic. The grove, it speaks. My heart, wait. A new apothic. We will learn its recipe, forage its ingredients. The grove needs this. New Loka needs this. It's time to wait. Androder! Thou should not be here! We are pure and true. Forgive our intrusion. Will you accept our protection? The Silver Grove must be confused about our pure and holy intentions. This new object may hold the key to making it understand. How is it that a spectre came to be in this most sacred shrine? Could this be a vestige of some earlier Orokin incursion? Operator, the codex system just pulled another voice entry from that apothic. Allow Odis to display it for you. My childhood dream has 
become a nightmare. I don't blame Margulis. She's as much a victim as the children we're working with. At first, the project seemed therapeutic and nurturing. I was myself. But now, transference therapy is being turned into a weapon. Now I build these vile weapons called Warframes, all for one purpose. Death. I've become everything I hate. I long for the discomfort of my damp tent, the sick, aimless trees, the barren soil. I know I left my soul behind back there. Titania is the next Warframe I've been commanded to build, but in secret, I've been siphoning resources from the project. I have an idea. A way back to that wounded land I call home. A way for me to forget this war and remember what I was. The Silver Grove is a pure and sacred force. Why would it be vandalized with such a message? Earth's oldest forest is populated with the first trees that evolved a resistance to the Orokin bondage. The rest of Earth is polluted with the monstrosities of their genetic tinkering. But these trees are pure. When we finally recede Earth, it will be with these specimens. The Silver Grove. In all the Operator's missions on Earth, Ordis has not scanned an area quite so... Magical! Unique. Ah, Lunar Pitcher. A flower that thrives on moonlight, but alas, without any moon, we feared one extinct long ago. We've searched everywhere on Earth for it. Where else would it grow?